Okay, part two on this. So I'm gonna show you each process, guys. Stepping it back. If you just watch part one, you know where we're at. If you're not, well, just watch. We just got done filtering the sky. I found this little red spot. Okay. Let me show you. That's it right there. So I started doing some exposing. It's there. Anyways, back to the original. This is a planet, guys. That is a little red spot. And that is some kind of a something a kind of cover up there on that city I declouded which I'm gonna do at the end of this video it might be a three-part video Thing looking. I'm gonna say something about this if you go to the original It just clears everything up, right? I ain't making nothing new. But notice how the bluish green haze is down there. Just kind of interesting. That light source right there. Pay attention. That's what I tell myself. Pay attention. Very hint, but when you use this filter, it just brings it out. It ain't adding the color to it, it's just enhancing the colors that are there. This is our normal dehaze filter. Okay, now as this thing comes in, watch how it develops, guys. It's insane looking. Crazy, right? Okay, I'm gonna do a little so these two videos I'm gonna just stay on this pretty interesting it's passing right there the planets I don't have my Samuel Hoffman picture up but I'll bring it up in a minute or maybe not you guys been around if you haven't been around long enough just go back on the videos you'll start learning as you go a lot of you guys know what you're looking at Samuel Hoffman model. This is the planet up here. I'm still going to stick with R2. Or R2 could have passed. So this could be R2 just coming in closer. Or past the clouds already. Here's your little red moon or planet. If that was a lens flare. Oh. You see this right here. Let's do something here. Notice the line right there. I know. If it's that big, we should be dead, right? Let me see if I could de uh, decloud that right now. Okay, so here we are at my erasing station. Let's see what we could do. I don't know if there's a city behind this, but let's just see. I'm going to erase the whole thing with this freehand um, I got to get around it I'm going to take this whole reflection or whatever it is out of the picture I don't know if there's going to be anything behind it we'll find out no nope. this is part of it up here nothing behind this so false flag on that one but notice that down here we've seen that green planet before right let's check that out ok 
Okay, I brought it back over here into my other station. You can still see hints of it, but it's pretty much was a distraction. This is a light bulb, guys. Don't worry about that. This is what I'm interested in. Let's turn the lights down. Ready? Strange, isn't it? What I'm doing here is I'm separating that as a separate picture and I'm going to re filter it. I think I left it in here. Okay, I'm back. I found it. I'm going to auto correct the colors again. Put the auto correct back off. I brought the light back up. What I'm trying to do here is see if this is a real planet right now. But I want to look for these. Super anomaly. separate it. Once you get the light too bright, you got to back it up to where you can see it good. So bring the lights down. What I'm trying to do is turn the lights down on it and uh, separate it. Anyways, you tell me if that's not two planets there. Alright, next picture. Enough of that. So you know there's nothing behind this uh, giant kite here. But maybe if it has the light in the middle of it, it's a better pick. <laughs> this is what I found on December 13th. Um, notice this up here. Like that Canadian flag flying. See that up there? Hercules, the giant gas giant planet right there. Watch. It's behind the sun. Or... There you go. See it sticking out? That's the gas giant. There it is. I'm using this uh, 4th of July filter. Puts it in a green mode. Is that not trippy or what? It's not the sun, guys. Okay, there's going to be a part three on this, I guess. <laughs> I don't care if there's five parts. But I'm doing it this way on purpose. Uh, people don't make it to the end of my video, so I'll be back. Part three coming. <laughs> 